Inconvenient Family and Farm. Hi, it's me, KJ, the filmer, because I slash off artist, and this is day eight of this trip, and it's also in fact need week two, by the way. Even though I'm just gonna let this video to continue on till day fourteen, which is probably the final week of week two or something like that. Even though I created like a journal to keep me track on what I was doing, so that I can just edit things better and not just mess up things a little bit. So anyhow. I'm not sure what else is going to, I'm going to do today, even though I'm wearing this band, unicorn bandana or something like that. So, we're just going to figure out what's going to happen next, and we're just going to find out and see what's going to happen, since I'm going to let this videotape roll on for week two. So, let's just figure out what's going to happen next, then. Why it was a nightmare? Well, you kind of read the description of why it was a Vendy total like nightmare and why it's like the first layer of the underworld of some sort. Well, it's because I feel like it's probably not vacation to be fair on you guys because I feel like I could just blame it all on my mom at first, okay? All because she gives them buying stuff every time we go, go on a vacation trip. And it's like she just violated one code of how to survive a vacation day on how to get started on a vacation day but I was planning on making part two which was about that list of things to travel while you're going on vacation so you won't be forgotful like I made mistakes all the time so pretty much what's going on was that we end up buying at least mattresses two sets of mattresses for the new house that is even though it's like for an extra large guest room over there and what happened was that one of the parts of the mattress well at least two parts of the mattress is flies out of the, the back of the truck that we were driving in and, and we had to pick it up and then well I didn't lose my cool for some reason on well it's just my my grandfather well my step grandfather just losing his cool for some reason on and and then my grandma later lo lost her cool and I know it's kind of a difficult trip to be fair on you guys especially when you're at relative's house and I just feel like I probably don't even have enough money for anything else even though my mom felt like she wants to go shopping and it wasn't really on my mom because she really was into making projects and and she does have her reasons why she was into projects like housing projects instead of like a film project or an art project that I had to work on well definitely the film project I had to work on because I just really don't want to give Thanksgiving disaster another excuse and whenever I go back I probably had to work on Thanksgiving disaster but I had to think about hiring a producer figure in order to just or an assistant director figure in order to make an animated fe feature film, a, a short animated feature film known as Thanksgiving Disaster. I'm not sure what's going to happen next, and then later Uncle Frank just came to the rescue, and he's not driving alone, he was actually driving with with his son John Lou, which is obviously my cousin John Lou, and he was also driving with his wife, and I actually did talk to John Lou, and here's a short videotape of him interviewing on John Lou. Hey John Lou, how's it going? Hi. <laughs> So what kind? Of, so what are you studying in college? Philosophy and women's studies. Oh, Dad. Yeah, I thought hey. Dad was. I meant not hey. Dad. Uh, I thought that that Uncle Frank was joking about that <laughs> thing, <laughs> and I thought you were into baseball or something. Well, as a matter of fact, my Uncle Frank was not making up this joke about him into women's study, but it actually does exist anyhow. Even though I thought it didn't even exist in the first place, but I thought he was just joking about it. But then again, I think across my mind that maybe 
Well, yeah, at least John Luke could have also been into baseball studies, for all I noticed. But then again, I just thought across my mind that I thought that maybe I'm good with my dad because we travel a lot without even thinking about stopping at, stopping at the mall when we arrived at the airport in order to get to Funville Kingdom for all I noticed. Well, same thing happened with me because I thought I was going to Funville Kingdom when we first arrived at, at some place. And we wound up going to Funville Mall, and my dad had a foot problem, and he had to buy it. And this happened to me when I was obviously in my young, when I was obviously just a younger teenager, from my nose, and I was so excited to go on a vacation trip. That was probably a long time ago. Oh yeah, one more thing, you know, is that this whole entire Funville thing. Yeah, that was actually Disney World, by the way, because I was talking about Disney World as well as it's Funville or something like that. Because in that vacation tips, yeah. I couldn't even say Disney World, so I ended up calling it Funville instead, which is a replacement, which is some kind of product replacement to deal with, especially when you're studying film or becoming a filmmaker like I am. So I'm just going to let this videotape roll on and continue on through all, throughout the weeks or so. So let's just go on and find out and see for ourselves then. Is gonna be like this is gonna be a nice summer home for me a what? winter getaway really wouldn't that be home for Andy Jenny and cousin Perkins ah uh, yeah but this is gonna be my summer getaway home <laughs> then we're getaway home get 12 miles away from my house <laughs> <laughs> I live 12 miles that way yeah and what do you think about these paintings over there you know, I just noticed you what? Had moss growing between the bricks. What? Yeah. That's a sophisticated idea. No, who does that? Oh yeah, that. Genius. Yeah, that would be me. You're quite possibly a genius. Thanks. Hi. It's me, KG, the filmmaker slash artist, and I'm here to send the videotape for week two. And I might have to make the next videotape, which is called week 2.5, which is kind of like week two and a half for some reason on. Even if you look at but pretty much something came out of it, except I just work on the artwork for this week for some reason on. So even though I'm still working on the artwork, it might even continue on. So I'm just going to have to end this videotape, and I might have to say thanks for watching this. You can just... Look up my new website and you can just hit the pink subscribe button on my new website for $10 per month and to watch the full version of the videotape. And you can also look at my other 
two channels and subscribe to me and you can also subscribe to this channel for free and you can also look on my playlist if you miss out on on me on Katie's Failing Fun and the rest so pretty much I'm going to have to say thanks for watching this so make sure you give the video a thumbs up if you like it subscribe to this video tape and make sure you give the artist a filmmaker a high five so thanks for watching